welcome back guys. Today we're playing something a little different. It may look a little bit similar with regards to the graphical styles, but we're playing, I believe it's called Realm Royale, and it's kind of like a like a battle royale game. You know, the sort of the, the big sort of hundred players all on one giant map, like a uh, sort of like PUBG, a bit like Fortnite. You know, these types of games. But it's actually from the makers of Paladins. So that's why the, obviously the graphical style looks very similar. So this, this should be quite fun to play. This is the very first game I've, I've played about. I've literally just loaded it up. So we're going to see how it plays. I've went the Hunter class. You get a bow and arrow, I believe. Things like that. So I'm not really sure of any of the controls. I'm not really sure how this works, but it's a fantasy based realm. So instead of being obviously like, you know, machine guns, you know, rocket launchers, these types of things. I think it's a, like I said, a little bit more fantasy based. I don't even, I don't even know the regions to go or anything. Uh, might, I'm just gonna jump out here. You know when you get the feeling something's not gonna go well. There's 82 players on this map, and 81 of them are against me. Like, how do I? Do I just? I don't have a parachute. Okay, I can do a forward roll. I have my knife. The movements are a little bit slow. I've got a jump. My guy's on a horse. Oh yeah, up the side. If I press Z. I can summon a mount. Ah, see, that's cool. Let's see, that's something these other sort of games are missing. Although, if you're playing Fortnite at the moment, you do have the shopping trolley, which I suppose that is a mount that you can get about on. Oh, is that a supply drop coming in over the distance? How do you know where they're going to land? Or do you have to shoot it down? Woohoo! Did that just land up on top of a cliff? I may have to go all the way around and get it. I fear I may get killed doing this. How do we open it? E. I have a gun with six bullets. Okay, so right trigger zooms in. Where is everybody? Or do I, I don't actually know if I want to find anybody. I'm a big massive fan. I play uh, Fortnite on my PS4. And I love like this type of game, but I am awful at them. I am terrible when it comes to Fortnite. On the odd occasions where I've actually won, it's either been through absolute fluke, or because for most of the match I haven't actually saw anybody. Uh oh, run! I'm a chicken. Ah, oh, okay then. I got eliminated very quickly. Okay, here we go again. As you may have saw from the last couple of minutes of gameplay, that first round was terrible. I died pretty quick. So what we're going to do now is we're going to try and get to grips with this a little bit more and see if we can at least survive for longer than a few moments. Now, I was reading some of the, the tips and tricks, and the key is to find chests. There's lots of equipment in the chests and armor as well. So you, you apparently get armor pieces and things like that inside chests. So, we need to find some. Aha. This is what I was talking about. Okay, there's one, revol one revolver just now. I'll take it. Can't speak at the moment. So, the right trigger. The right trigger. So Sounds like I'm using a controller. So, your mouse button. And your right one. That sort of zooms in a bit. Those are some funky mushrooms over there. Anyway, so that zooms in and then obviously your normal mouse button shoots. I'm going to try and make my way up to this funky house up here. See if there's any other weapons. And because of the type of character I am, which is the sort of ranged 
what was it? Was it Ranger class? Yeah. You've got this forward roll. Wait. Uh oh, did I hear somebody shooting there? Oh, we've got another chest here. What's in this one? Ooh. Ooh, this is more of like a ranged. Oh, uh, run. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Over at this rock. Ah, I see it. They're still over there. Do I have a crouch button? Whoa, 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 whoa. You can fly? Yeah, we might not want that house anymore. One would assume that's one of the the abilities of one of the other character classes, the ability to sort of shoot across a level. Oh, I see you over there. Oh, come on. What are you doing? Come back out. This isn't doing you any favours. You know, for the amount of times I play these games, like I mentioned before, obviously I play the... Oh, this is going to hurt, isn't it? No, no, that's not too bad. Yeah, for the amount of times I play, like, Fortnite and things like that, I should be better at, like, multiplayer games online. Definitely should be a lot better. Brown I mean, is single-player games. It's just the minute somebody else turns up and starts taking shots at me, I'm like, oh my god, run. <laughs> and... Ooh, a shotgun. And a rifle. The fog sets in. Now here's some armor, that's what I was looking for. Uh, yeah. Equip this. Because it's got more bullets. Although it's not as nice as the one I've got. Is there a way to buy ammo or something? I have no idea. I definitely hear people running about me. Okay, so the fog will be setting in soon. So I need to get in the circle, which... Do I have a button to bring up a map? I really should have looked at the, the actual buttons. So that tab. Okay. See, this is why, before I record a game, I should really play a couple of, like, matches first, just to kind of get used to it. But I thought, you know what? I'll just jump into this straight away and see what happens. Come on. I take it getting, like, some sort of power sprint as an ability you might add later on or unlock later on, because your character feels like they run a little bit slow. Oh, look, another floating bush. Yeah, I imagine there's going to be lots of uh, sort of glitches or, or graphical bugs. Like, say, it is in a sort of beta stage at the moment. There's not much to it. But that's not to say it doesn't look pretty. I mean, the the player the so the, the player designs are very generic fantasy, but I like the levels. Or sorry, I like the level, the map. So somebody's already been here. I see like a, on the map up top there, it looks like a, an anvil. Is it like a blacksmith or something? Can, I wonder if you can upgrade weapons and things like that in game. How far along is it? Ooh, I guess someone died here.
Ooh, crossbow. A helmet as well. And is that a pair of boots? I don't mind if I do. I'm not really sure what's going on here. Oh, that's the... There's a fog coming in. So the in here? I don't have... Oh, armor quality too low. So where is this? Oh. Is there someone already at it? Because there's things moving. Run! Oh man, they got me. Okay. I play 25th with zero eliminations. That sounds exactly like every match of Fortnite I play. I'm kind of understanding how the weapons work and how the game works now. The, the two types of weapons I had, they were kind of ranged weapons. And up close, they were absolutely terrible. So I'm trying to go for maybe like a shotgun. And that's a ranged weapon as well, so I've kind of got the ability to take people out of close range. i tell you what, if we're getting launched out of a Zeppelin airship thing, and landing the ground from that height without a parachute, I'm impressed. So how is it a bullet can kill me, but fall damage won't? Come on, I could not get past that bit of wall there. I'm not really sure, so I think this is two ranged ones I've got. We'll take the armor, that'll always come in handy. Oh, there's a chest in the middle of here. Crossbow, so I'll equip that one. Change it out for the... Obviously the different rarities, the levels I assume mean more damage. I'm not sure what the levels actually are. I assume there's something at the top of this tower, which is not easy to navigate, by the way. Mm, the armor, okay. I'm not really sure about the sword. Is there anything in the surrounding circle at the top? I say surrounding circle. I'm not sure what this actual part of a castle is called. So, you know, if you do know what this is called, so leave it down in the comments. Let's educate everybody while we're playing games, eh? Oh, I thought that... I, at the side of my eye, I saw something I genuinely thought was another player, not realizing it was a bloody chandelier. But candelabra, chandelier, yeah. Whatever one it was, it was that. So I'm going to make our way across to this other one. Now, I have my forward roll, but I've got a new one, which is in three. What does it do? Is that going to explode? No idea. Like I said, I really should learn also the mechanics of the game before I get into it. Oh, it's a flare. Find a flare that reveals enemies in a large way, it says. A helmet. I'll take that as well. So I take this castle is going to follow the same principle as the last one. Ooh. Do I equip it? In one. You know it's probably going to be worse, but at this point in the game, I don't think weapons are going to make me any better. So this an explosive projectile that damages. So let's have a look for. Nice. See, I'm tempted to jump off of here, because do you suffer fall damage? Clearly not, from the fact that you just sort of superhero landed that. Well, that's good to know. Like, say, 
I can jump off, jump from a plane or from a, an aircraft. I can jump off a mountain and not take any damage. Now switch to my ranged one. Or did he run away? I think he ran away. Ah. Whoa. Maybe not. The fog sets in. Run. Okay, so this time I'm going to try something different. We're getting some of the mechanics down, and I'm slowly lasting longer and longer each round. But I've decided to change to the Assassin class, as you can see from the different character on screen. The Assassin class has got a quicker ground speed, and I think better with sort of, well, assassin based long range weapons, sniper rifles, that sort of thing. So I wonder if changing the, the type of character will do any better. Okay, you clearly can't land on roofs, which is makes you just slide down them looking real weird. So, what's my ability as an assassin? Teleport forward a little bit? Okay. I think he seems a little bit quicker. Not really. Not really sure. What's this helmet. A uh, concussion bomb. Smoke screen. Or ghost walk. Become un untargetable and move 20% faster. Or throw a smoke screen that blocks vision. I'll take Ghost Walk, that sounds cool. So that would be... Okay. I'm going to stick with these weapons. Now I'm not, not going to take the sword. I'm not really sure how you use potions though. Hmm. I'll have to find that one out. Because again, there's no use in playing the game. If I don't know how to even just, you know, take a potion. This chest looks really glowy from quite a far away. Armor potion. A shotgun. I think we're going to keep the shotgun. I'll use range for distance, and obviously, when I get up close, I can use my shotgun. That's if I manage to get up close without dying horrendously. Ooh, some nice shoes. Nope, that's cool, that's fine. I'll make sure I mine the... I am in the circle, so that's something. I think there's also some sort of mechanic in the game where you can actually disassemble things and use shards. I assume maybe that's what the guy was doing at the blacksmith place when he was... He looked like he was upgrading stuff before I interrupted him. In case you didn't notice that, that was in the last game there. The, the guy I was approaching, he was inside a building that had like a little... Uh, it's an anvil, and as far as I'm aware, I think that's for upgrading weapons or or purchasing weapons. I'm not 100% sure the, let's say, the exact mechanics behind it. Where is that thing dropping? I keep hearing a little helicopter. I'll tell you what, unlike Fortnite though, you won't be hiding in any bushes, will you? These things are solid. I mean, not that I hide in bushes. You know, I'm a, I'm a proper offensive player. I don't hide away until the last, like, you know, five and then try and win. No siree. Yep. 
kind of confused as to what's going on. The fog sets in. Thank you for updating me. The fog is apparently setting in. One would assume that's what the little exclamation mark on my screen with a little bar building up under the map is. I looked at it the other round and thought, what is that? But it seems to have only popped up on the screen. So this is a slightly better version of the ghost walk. I've got boots, I've got a shotgun. I've got that as well. I'm still in it. Yeah, I'm still in the circle. There's down to the last 37, well, there's 37 people left and I'm not really seeing anybody. How, wait, what? This particular ramp goes to nowhere. Well, that's not at all strange. Nope. Lots of chests. I need gloves. I say gloves. I need braces, gauntlets, I don't know what you are. Greaves, I'm, I'm not sure which one goes where. Whatever the fantasy term is for, like, you know, sturdy gloves. Where am I going? I thought I saw something up here. See, on these massive, like, What's the name of sort of battle royale style games? I am terrible for having the sort of inability to see like people in the distance. See when you watch some of the YouTubers. I mean, I I watch a a YouTuber a Wildcat, and if you watch him in some of his videos, he's shouting off like to people in the distance in Fortnite. They are they are so tiny to see on your screen. I think how the hell did you notice that? So if you don't, if you do see someone in my video, and I just miss them completely, that's that's because I'm blind, because I'm 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 just terrible. I mean, I think I could actually put my head as close to my monitor as need be, and it still wouldn't do a damn thing. Look, another chest. At this point, this is just a chest opening simulator. That sounds gross. Chest opening simulator. It sounds like a surgical simulator. See, look, disenchant for five shards. Let's try that. Okay, I collected some shards. Ooh, that looks like it's a lot better than the one I've got. And then I can disenchant this one. Disenchanting it sounds like I'm letting it down in life, you know, like I've. like I've ruined its dreams. Where was that forge thing? There's a pair of gloves in amongst... And it says it's in here. Okay, so I can... Buy stuff, make stuff... Okay, I don't, have, I don't think I have enough to make anything, but... No, so that was a bit pointless. Oh, I'm way out of the zone. I did not even notice that at the top of my map there. Come on. Go up here and then round. So yeah, so you need to take apart a lot of those weapons and get these shards for them. And apparently that is what you use. Is it shards and it looked like a food icon? I'm not sure with the little... It's like a chicken leg thing. Oh, oh! Where were those shots coming from? I know. Four. And then... Yeah. Where'd he go? He's still up there. Is 
Stay still. You're not making this easy for me. Uh oh. Uh, ghost walk and make myself unkillable for a little bit while I get closer to the zone. I wonder. Kill him. No, I'm reloading. Don't let him respawn. I killed someone. Okay, I am successfully half decent in this game. I'm gonna die now. Oh well. I'm in the zone. <laughs> Oh, are you kidding me? I got in the zone, ended up getting hit, and somebody started shooting at me as well. Okay, I'm going to have to leave this one here. I may go back and play this a little bit in between games and try and get a little bit better at it because I am absolutely terrible at it. And if you are a fan of Paladins, well, it's made by the same people, same sort of visual styles, so give it a go. But yeah, I'm, I'm, like I say, I'm going to play, I'm going to get a little bit better at it, upload some more videos. But I'll leave this one here. If you've enjoyed this, hit the like button. Leave a comment down below if you're thinking of playing this, if you've played it, how you're finding it once you get a bit more sort of leveled up. Or, and if you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one.